We're off again. We're just leaving Market Bosworth. When we left the very bougie town of Market Bosworth to continue our journey along the Ashby Canal, we planned to go to the end, turn around and come back again in one journey, just to kind of say we'd completed it. We had to make our way back in the opposite direction, so we weren't planning to linger at this end, but after only an hour and a half of travel, we got to Shackerston and that plan just flew out of the window. So we emerged from underneath a bridge as normal to this absolute oil painting of a scene with sheep and lambs grazing right up against moored boats, some kind of body of water and a giant mound. It was just surreal. I was following a text-only guide to the moorings and the local attractions while we were travelling, which didn't mention that it was the most beautiful place on earth, and I hadn't seen any photos or videos of it, it just appeared like some kind of mirage. But a mirage with some wide open visitor moorings. One thing I noticed since living on a boat is what I call boating time. And obviously I've made this up, but I define boating time as the feeling of time going at a different speed when you're travelling by boat. Maybe it's that we move very slowly, but something happens to the hours and the days. They stretch out. A few hours into a journey, you feel like you've arrived somewhere completely different, even though you're probably only in the next county, if that. But something about boating time hits different. Days feel really long. And this vlog is about one such day. We saw some resident boaters as we cruised by and we said something like, wow, what an incredible place. And they were like, you should moor up. And that's another thing I've learned about boating so far. If the vibe is good, pull over. Stay the night, stay two weeks. And if you're not feeling it, cancel your plans and move on. You have to go with your instincts. And our instincts were telling us to turn around and moor up. So that's exactly what we did. They said heaven doesn't exist, but they haven't been to Shackleton. We headed out to have a look around the village and see if we could hunt down something for dinner because we were running quite low on food. There isn't a shop here, so we headed towards the village pub called The Rising Sun. But unfortunately, their kitchen was closed. They suggested we try the Globe Inn in the next village along called Snareston, about an hour's walk along the canal. Obviously, we could have just jumped back on the boat and gone down there, but we were absolutely enamoured with our view, so we decided, no, we're staying here in Sheepy Mound Paradise, and we'll walk down there and get our steps in. How much for in London for that? Oh, As that's a good one. It's got a good space, really good natural light. So like pending location, probably 2,200 a month. Before bills, yeah. obviously. We basically walked the last bit of the canal, almost the very end of the Ashby. Or the very end of the Ashby for now, should I say, because it's currently in the long and slow process of being restored.
several miles in search of food. There's no food. They stopped serving at five. It's now 7.20. We forgot we were in the countryside and that it's a bank holiday. So we're gonna survive because we've got crisps and a pint. So we're gonna be fine. Refueling for the walk back. We've got food at home. Yeah, we're gonna be fine. I'm just seeing all the food over your shoulder that we could have had. It's actually quite devastating. Well priced food. Yeah, but it was probably eat. really good. Damn you. Damn you time. The passing of time. No one else to blame. Even though we missed the food service because it was a bank holiday, the people in the pub could not have been nicer and the staff and the local residents were trying to come up with somewhere else we could go to get food. Someone actually called another restaurant to see if their kitchen was still open. Everyone was just so, so lovely. Look at the beautiful light. I've got the camera on my nice. face. But there was nothing doing. Everything was closed and that's village life for you. You snooze, you lose. But after a pint and a packet of crisps, we were actually sufficiently fueled for the return journey. They're not there yet. So sad. He's learning how Why to do Why Oh my god, a cow's got in the situation. The has uh, taken an unexpected We've turn. Got some as drama, a there calf. is a calf and it's just trotting along over there. Look, the, the way the horse is looking at it, it's like, uh, should you be here, my man? My guy? They're all looking. They're, they're the all whole looking. family is like, they're like um, holy he, shit, he there's a horse. To get back to his family. I mean, there's a cow, yeah. Look, they're all like, he's oh running alongside my God. them. Oh, God, please get through the fence. Oh, the drama of this. Do you think he's going to get through over there? Oh, God. Okay, he's, he's going. Can, can he, he get back it? in? Can I didn't know. I think he got through that hole through there. I don't think he can get there. Oh, God, this is terrible. Unfortunately, because he's a calf, he's really stupid. Oh, my God, he's running. He's all stressed. Oh god, this is a disaster. Oh, I'm so sh We need to go find a farmer. Oh my god, look, he's Yeah, like, he's he wants running. to get to his family. He's lost them. Fuck. And the, the horses are all like, what's happening over here? <laughs> they seem quite unsettled. They're like, um, there's a calf in our field, so. Look, I mean, the. the the farm is right there, so it's not like we're in the middle of nowhere. The, the farm okay, is wait, okay. Wait. He's running he's back. He's getting a clue. He's gonna have to retrace yeah. the steps all the way. Come on, mate. Come on. Come on. We're rooting for you. Oh, he's running around. It's like, it's not gonna... This could be a long night. Okay, okay. What's he gonna okay, do? Okay, Dad. Gonna... Dad, come horse, on, come dad on. horses. All In the family. there, look. Family is gonna work together to get this uh, cow out. I think the horses might need to handle the situation. Yeah. Might the horses, like, herd the cow? Oh, it, it's going back to the gap. Come on. Come okay, on. Okay, okay, okay. Come on. Oh, man. No, it's not come the wrong on, come it's on. that middle one. Look, the horses are literally showing you where yeah, to yeah. go. Like, right there, man. Oh, oh, oh my God, man. it's a now standoff. A confrontation. I, don't I have actually oh. never seen anything like this happen. I don't know what's going to happen. Are the horses going to be, like, mad? I, I don't actually want to see gonna... the dad horse get involved. Yeah, we don't want to, like... Yeah, yeah. I'm not going to kick it or anything. I think they're trying to just gently but firmly there, yes. escort it to the hole in the fence that it needs to go through. Come on, guy, we're rooting for It's not this yes. one, but can it yes. get through this one? Yes, it might this be able is to get it. This is how one. it got through. Come oh on. my god! Come on. Oh, thank God, he's going. He's gone. Oh, and there's he's his mom. gone. Okay, I think I might have lost focus there because I was literally so excited that it happened. He's gone. It's fine. It's it's all okay. Nature. It's like not a dull moment in the countryside, it's bloody constant. Look at the moon, look at it. What is it up to? What is it ever up to?
We got back to Shackerston, but it seemed rude not to also check out the rising sun for a quick pint, you know, for review purposes, so we headed back there again. I mean, this is turning into a pub crawl at this point, but we're just doing our best to showcase the local amenities. Obviously, we here are seeing the harsh reality of boating life. Yeah, it's, it's grim. It's a real struggle. But we soldier bravely on. us being the only people in this pub. Like, the, the, the owner. Proprietor. The proprietor. <laughs> the owner of the pub is outside having a fact. Like, we're, we're the only people in this pub. It's also a very strong side. It's... <laughs> 7.8. <laughs> the arm holding up this camera has, has had a lot of side there. But, um, yeah. I hope the stabilisation works. The stabilisation. Have to work over quite top. <laughs> the cider was fantastic and this pub was unbelievable this, this is like i've never been to a pub like this as in it was fucking empty and the music was lit it's the they best. Tell us it's just a i would say this playlist. is the best pub yeah like it's a spotify playlist but it's a spotify playlist that i would listen to so it's a, a lit spotify playlist and there's no one else here it's like it's perfect Perfect pub. <laughs> music is so good. Come on. Okay, this so was we... the village pub. It was wonderful. I think it was a perfect pub. I'm not sure you could ever like replicate the perfection of that pub, but it was wonderful. There was no one else there. There was no one else there. Look how good it is. Look how good the torch is. It just lights your way the whole way. Look at this. Unbelievable. Let's go. Oh, it came out of nowhere. This <laughs> <laughs> is a very short walk. It's the kind of walk I like between yeah. my local exactly. pub. Yes. Okay, look at Three Never ciders. <laughs> Two sizes in again. <laughs> I'm, I'm literally fine. I'm honestly absolutely fine. Always drink responsibly. Narrowboat home, it could be your floating narrowboat home. Come on. Haven't you always dreamt of being on the bridge? <laughs> <laughs>